my Savior stood and wept at Jerusalem. Okay, I think it is Matthew 19, 17 through, Matthew 16, 17 through 19. I'm going to read a verse here. Um, Jesus replied to Simon Peter, Blessed are you, Simon, son of jo Jonah, for this was not revealed to you by flesh and blood, but by my Father in heaven. And I tell you that you are Peter, and on this rock I will build my church, and the gates of Hades or hell will not overcome it. I will give you the keys of the kingdom of heaven. Whatever you bind on earth will be bound in heaven, and whatever you loose on earth will be loosed in heaven. I'll go ahead and read the last verse, verse 20. Then he ordered his disciples not to tell anyone that he was the Messiah. Okay. What are the keys to the I'm kingdom? Pray us out. Father, I lift this group up to you, Father, in Jesus' name. There are some that all have, including myself, various needs, various questions, Holy Spirit. I'm asking that you answer each and every one of us according to the way that you would like us to operate and how you would like us to interact with one another. Uh, Lord, I'm asking that um, if anyone in here needs to recommit their lives, Lord, I just give you all the glory and all the praise. But if you would look at... Uh, the total, Matthew 16, that part in there is about the keys of the kingdom. And we need to find out what are those keys. If you're binding and loosing, doesn't that mean that if you're loosing health on somebody, that that would be a key? If you're binding a spirit, that would be a key? What are your ideas about what is a key and let's take a look at that because he said he was giving peter the keys that means we get them too right. throughout the earthly years we shouts of joy shall read treasure to keep god God. 